So uh, Mazen, the Moroccan Agency for Sustainable Energy, was created at uh, the first, on 2010, as the Moroccan Agency for Solar Energy. Uh, with the, the project that we have uh, developed, uh, the success we have met in developing the, the first uh, world-class solar power complex uh, with 518 megawatts. Uh, with storage, which was a, a kind of disruptive uh, project on the, on the industry. The thought on uh, the institutional framework was taken to say, OK, we have uh, done something for a certain context because solar was very uh, first common technology. Right now we can go further to improve the interaction in terms of conception, in terms of uh, maintenance, in terms of uh, exploitation of all the renewable technologies. And that's why Mazen has been uh, in charge uh, since one year ago of all the renewable energy in Morocco and it became the Moroccan Agency for Sustainable Energy. And uh, the goals that was uh, defined for uh, 2020 to 42 persons of uh, the installed capacity from renewable energy in the Moroccan mix has been increased to 52 percent by 2030 which means that uh, Morocco will be one of uh, the few countries where uh, the renewable capacities will exceed in the near future the fossil fuels ones. We try to found answers to our need we try to give answers to our issues. Morocco is a country that is poor in fossil fuel. It is uh, importing more than 19%, 90% of its energy from abroad, which creates a big uh, dependency from abroad. Morocco is a country that is experiencing very high growth, which means that the need uh, uh, are growing by almost five to seven percent each year, which, uh, which means that we need to double our capacities by each decade. So with that, with the, the fact that we want to improve the well-living of uh, the Moroccan household, the equipment of them, the will of uh, giving good energy, available one, to the industry and to the economy in general, has driven Morocco to set a very ambitious renewable energy program, evaluating the good renewable energy resources that are available, very good solar radiation, very good wind spots from world-class uh, capacity that give us the opportunity with the, the openness of the Moroccan economy, its tradition to, ho to, to host private finance, private sector, to optimize all these levers to go forward and to make renewable energy very competitive, very competitive to serve uh, the well-being, to create a new industrial cluster and to catch more value added in a sector that will uh, know a very bright future. Yeah, this is indeed, this is absolutely true. Uh, today we are, uh, um, we are uh, approached by uh, several uh, sub-Saharan countries and uh, also some neighbors uh, to share with them experience. We have signed uh, no less than uh, 10 uh, MOUs to give, uh, to share the experience, to give the best practices, but also to foresee development of projects. Uh, you are better, uh, you know better than me than Africa is a country where, where at least 700 million of people have not access to electricity, where the level of uh, electrification is uh, decreasing because the, the, the increase of the demography is uh, much more than the increase of infrastructure. Renewable energy can really give a very shortcut to this, uh, to this situation and can be an acceleration to make people get in line, to make people uh, uh, 
improving their uh, social status, making education, helping uh, in the health to have some... Uh, so all that, I think that all the humanity should care of this problem. Africa cannot... And Mazen is trying to contribute at the level it can to this dynamic with uh, sharing all uh, what we have uh, accumulated from uh, our experience in this field. This is one of uh, things that are very proud of it. Uh, as you know, Mazen has established a very innovative scheme to develop the project where we organize absolutely everything. We, we are the sponsor of the project. We prepare the infrastructure. We give the pre-feasibility studies, the pre-acceptance environmental uh, issues. Uh, we mobilize financing to the project and we let the developer, the private sector, a window to improve only one thing, the consumption of the power plants, only to do what they do best, which is. And for that, we, as, the mar as the market was uh, open and was keen to receive these first uh, things, we have issued uh, almost uh, more than 100 million euros in uh, bonds, green bonds, that was uh, concluded in the COP22 that hold place in Marrakesh, in Morocco, and has served to partially finance the NOR PV1 project, which is a 117 megawatts, 170 megawatts of uh, photovoltaic uh, capacity spread on Werzazet, Layoun and Bojdor projects. It was over six pride and it was reserved at uh, the institutional uh, uh, companies and finally only uh, the, we get uh, four clients that, that oversubscribe that subscribe all the needs of the projects. Okay. And we are expecting to to mobilize all the climate uh, finance. Uh, as uh, an optimization to the financial structure, but also to introduce innovative scheme of financing for the renewable energy. Because as you know, these projects are very long-term projects, 25-year terms, uh, very capitalistic in the upfront, and uh, which need very uh, clear, dedicated tools, guarantee, and uh, and 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 uh, a good. Uh, price of uh, money because uh, pow renewable power plants are burning amortization and are burning financial burden. So whenever you optimize the financial structure, you get it on the price of the electricity and you make it cheap. From the bond, yeah. we as an issuer, we expect the lowest uh, the lowest uh, interest rate and the longest term. I think uh, at least for Morocco 2018 will be a very uh, very good year because uh, we will um, at least uh, have to operate to make under operation initial operation uh, two major solar thermic projects, Norwell ZZ2 and Norwell ZZ3, and also three projects in uh, photovoltaics. So uh, 2018, we'll also, we will uh, we'll also record uh, the launch and uh, the conclusion of a major new uh, hybrid project that we are developing in uh, Middles, where we have two times 400 megawatts that are today under the bidding process. We will, we will award uh, 800 megawatts of those. So this is also will be a, a good will be a, a, a news for 2018, the last thing of 2018. But we will launch also, and that's why we are here, we are making our market sounding, uh, uh, we will launch uh, the new phase 
of our uh, PV program, which will reach high uh, capacities. We are speaking about uh, several hundreds of megawatts of PV capacity.